These two pictures show two old worms at the same age. The one on the right has been treated with a drug that increases its L span and lifespan. In The Fountain by Darren Aronofsky, the fear of death and fragility of human life are a common denominator throughout the whole movie. Such innate fear has been driving the human race to find a solution to alter the course of normal aging. Until recently, the possibility of reaching a non-aging state like Dorian Gray's character or finding the fountain of youth was remote, unless you're Jack Sparrow or Indiana Jones. We scientists decided to have a different approach to this task. We gave up on finding the fountain's geographic location and instead wanted to create one, but with one important difference. Our aim is not to create a fountain to increase lifespan to infinity, but instead to reduce a sizable proportion of human suffering derived from the effects of growing old. Aging is the predominant risk factor for the many horrible illnesses of later life, including heart problems, cancer and dementia such as Alzheimer's disease. If we can develop a drug or polypill containing a combination of drugs that can target and cure aging, we might then help treat many of the ailments occurring later in life. Excellent progress has already been achieved worldwide, with some drugs robustly extending health span and lifespan in several model organisms, such as worms. At the Institute of Healthy Aging, we are also pursuing this goal, and our results are promising. As Jack Sparrow would say, Death lies before us as we sail to the fountain of youth.